What's good y'all, Kyle Loftus here. 50 tips for filmmakers in 50 days. Today I wanna to talk to you guys about controlling and shaping your light. First and foremost, shouts to Justin Jones, an incredible cinematographer. He taught me this um, early in my career, but today we're talking about honeycomb grids and the power and impact of using them. So what is a honeycomb grid? A honeycomb grid is what I'm utilizing right now on my softbox. And what it allows me to do is really control and shape the light. It's so important that you're truly able to master and control the light exactly how you want to. Um, and so utilizing a grid is a great resource to do so. But first and foremost, guys, I just wanna quickly demonstrate the difference of utilizing the grid. So again, right now as I'm talking to you guys, we've got the grid on, but I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick snap and it's suddenly gonna be gone and you guys are gonna notice the huge difference. So let's do it. So as you guys can see here, the light is already a bit harsher, right? Like we've killed out some of that softness and you can see how it's starting to spread all over the room, right? I'm getting less control. I have less opportunity to shape and alter that light. So again, just by implementing a grid, you can again kind of further that, that softness with the light. And again, you're able to better shape and control your image, right? That, that's the whole point behind being a cinematographer is we are trying to shape, control, and alter the light to, to create a specific look and image in the camera that, that reflects the story we're trying to tell. So again, guys, definitely go pick yourself up a grid so you can better control and shape your light.